Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawak. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in which we are partaking of Christ, the suffering is our member. Our minds are filled with His grace, and we receive the blessing of the glory which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food, and this bread contains all goodness. Let us pray, Lord Jesus Christ, you gave us the Eucharist as a memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you want for us and the peace of the kingdom. We live to the Father and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh, and the wealth among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour forth, we beseech you, O Lord, your grace into our hearts, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ your Son was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection. Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Sorrowful Mysteries The first sorrowful mystery, the agony in the garden. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second sorrowful mystery, the scourging at the pillar. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third sorrowful mystery, the crowning with thorns. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth sorrowful mystery, the carrying of the cross. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fifth sorrowful mystery, the crucifixion and death of Jesus. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, <coughs> pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O Holy Mother of God, despise not our petitions and our necessities, but deliver us from all dangers, O ever-glorious and blessed Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawa, pray for us, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by His life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, Grant, we beseech you, that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Prayer to Saint Joseph. Behold the faithful and prudent steward, whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him in his splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, you entrusted our Savior to the care of St. Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may our Church continue to serve our Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Prayer for Dominican vocations. Lord Jesus Christ, 
your love for Saint Dominic inspires us now to implore your help and seek an intercession for all the Dominicans in the Philippines and the whole world. In confidence, we ask you to strengthen them with the virtues of chastity, poverty, and obedience, that they may live with one mind and heart, lead to the order men and women, willing to live and preach the truth of the gospel, after the example of Saint Dominic, and mercifully grant that we may all be moved with the zeal for your glory in saving souls, and become partakers of your crown in heaven. Amen. Saint Dominic de Guzman, Pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Sisters, welcome to the minor basil. Welcome to the minor basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. The liturgy of the hours is the official public prayer of the church and the source of nourishment for personal prayer. It is devised so that the whole course of the day and night will be made holy by praising God. We will now have the office of readings and the morning prayer of the church. We invite you to please actively participate in our prayers. Please all stand. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. Come, let us worship Christ, the Son of God, who redeemed us with his blood. Come, let us worship Christ, the Son of God, who redeemed us with His blood. Come, let us sing to the Lord, and show the joy to the Rock who saves us. Let us approach Him with praise and thanksgiving, and sing joyful songs to the Lord. 
Come, let us worship Christ, the Son of God, who redeemed us with His blood. The Lord is so mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in His hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to Him. The dry land too, for it was formed by His hands. Come, let us worship Christ, the Son of God, who redeemed us with His blood. Come, then let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For He is our God, and we are His people the flock he shepherds. Come, let us worship Christ, the Son of God, who redeemed us with his love. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness. When at Meribah and Masa, they challenged me and provoked me. Although they had seen all of my works. Come, come, let us worship Christ, the Son of God, who redeemed us with His blood. For tears I endure that generation. I said, there are people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Come, let us worship Christ, the Son of God, who redeemed us with His blood. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning is now and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us worship Christ, the Son of God, who redeemed us with His blood. Your cross, the Savior said, If you would my disciple be, Did I yourself the world forsake, And humbly follow after me? Take up your cross, let not its weight, Fill your weak spirit with alarm. His strength shall bear your spirit up. Shall raise your heart and nerve your heart. Earthly kings rise up in revolt, princes conspire together against the Lord and His anointed. Why this tumult among nations, among peoples this useless murmuring? They arise, the kings of the earth, princes plot against the Lord and His anointed. Come, let us break their fetters, come, let us cast off their yoke. He who sits in the heaven laughs, and the Lord is laughing down to scorn. Then he will speak in his anger, his rage will strike them with terror. It is I who have set up my king, on Zion my holy mountain. I will announce the decree of the Lord. The Lord said to me, You are my son, it is I who have begotten you this day. Us and I shall be with you the nations. Put the ends of the earth in your possession. With a rod of iron you will break them, shatter them like a potter's jar. 
Now, now kings understand, take warning, rulers of the earth, serve the Lord with all, and trembling pay him your homage, lest he be angry and you perish, for suddenly his anger will blaze. Blessed are they who put their trust in God. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. They divided my garments among them. They cast laws for my clothing. My God, my God, why have you forsaken me? You are far from my plea and the cry of my distress. O oh my God, I call by day and you give no reply. I call by night and I find no peace. Yet you, O oh God, are holy, enthroned on the praises of Israel. In you our fathers put their trust, they trusted and you set them free. When they cried to you they escaped, in you they trusted and never in vain. But I am a worn and no man, scorned by men, despised by the people. All who see me deride me, they curl their lips, they toss their heads. He trusted in the Lord, let him save him. Let him release him if this is his friend. Yes, it was you who took me from the womb, entrusted me to my mother's breast. To you I was committed from my birth, from my mother's womb you had been my God. Do not leave me alone in my distress. Come close, there is none else to help. Many bulls have surrounded me, fierce bulls of Bashan close me in. Against me they open wide their doors, like lions rending and roaring. Like water I am poured out, disjointed are all my bones. My heart has become like wax, it is melted within my breast. Parts has burned clay is my throat, my tongue cleaves to my jaws. Many dogs have surrounded me, a band of the wicked beset me. They tear holes in my hands and my feet, and lay me in the dust of the death. I can count every one of my bones. These people stare at me and rule. They divide my clothing among them. They cast lots for my robe. O oh Lord, do not leave me alone. My strength make haste to help me. Rescue my soul from the sword. My life from the grief of these dogs, save my life from the jaws of these lions, my poor soul from the horns of these oxen. I will tell of your name to my brethren, and praise you where they are assembled. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. They sought to take my life by violence. O oh Lord, do not rebuke me in your anger. Do not punish me, Lord, in your rage. Your arrows have sunk deep in me. Your hand has come down upon me. Through your anger, O oh, my body is sick. Through my sin, there is no help in my limbs. My guilt towers higher than my head. It is a way too heavy to bear. My wounds are foul and festering, the result of my own folly. I am bowed and brought to my knees, I go mourning all the day long. All my frame burns with fever, all my body is sick, spent and utterly crushed. I cry aloud in anguish of heart. O Lord, hear all my longing, my groans are not hidden from you. My heart throbs, my strength is spent, the very light has gone from my eyes. My friends avoid me like a leper, those closest to me stand as far off. Those who plot against my life lay snares, those who seek my ruin speak of harm. 
planning treachery all the day long. But I am like the deaf who cannot hear, like the dumb unable to speak. I am like a man who hears nothing, in whose mouth is no defense. I count on you, O Lord. It is you, Lord God, who will answer. I pray, do not let them mock me, those who triumph if my foot should slip. For I am on the point of falling, and my pain is always before me. I confess that I am guilty, and my sin fills me with dismay. My wanton enemies are numberless, and my lying foes are many. They repay me evil for good, and attack me for seeking what is right. O Lord, do not forsake me. My God, do not stay afar off. Make haste and come to my help. O Lord, my God, my Savior. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. false evidence against me they were breathing out fury please be seated a reading from the letter to the Hebrews when Christ came as high priest of the good things which have come to be. He entered once for all into the sanctuary, passing through the greater and more perfect tabernacle, not made by hands, that is, not belonging to this creation. He entered not with the blood of goats and calves, but with his own blood and achieved eternal redemption. For if the blood of goats and bulls and a sprinkling of a heifer's ashes can sanctify those who are defiled so that their flesh is cleansed, how much more will the blood of Christ, who through the eternal Spirit offered himself up, unblemished to God, cleanse our consciences from dead works to worship the living God? This is why he is the mediator of a new covenant, since his death has taken place for deliverance from transgressions committed under the first covenant. Those who are called may receive the promised eternal inheritance. Where there is a testament, it is necessary that the death of the testator be confirmed. For a testament comes into force only in the case of death. It has not force, it has no force while the testator is alive. Hence, not even the first covenant was inaugurated without blood. When Moses had read all the commandments of the law to the people, he took the blood of goats and calves together with water and crimson wool and hyssop and sprinkled the book and all the people saying this is the blood of the covenant which God has enjoined upon you he will he also sprinkled the tabernacle and all the vessels of worship with blood according to the law almost everything is purified by blood and without the shedding of blood there is no forgiveness. It is necessary that the copies of heavenly models be purified in this way, but the heavenly realities themselves called for better sacrifices. For Christ did not enter into a sanctuary made by hands, a mere copy of the true one. He entered heaven itself, that he might appear before God now on our behalf, not that he might offer himself there 
again and again as the high priest enters year after year in the sanctuary with blood that is not his own. If that were so, he would have had to suffer for death over and over from the creation of the world. But now, he has appeared at the end of the ages to take away sins once for all by the, his sacrifice. Just as it is appointed that men die once and after death be judged. So Christ was offered up once to take away the sins of many. He will appear a second time, not to take away sin, but to bring salvation to those who eagerly await him. He was led like a lamb to the slaughter, no complaint from his lips against the evil done to him. He was given up to death to give his people life. He surrendered himself to death and was counted among the wicked to give his people life. From the Catechesis by St. John Chrysostom, Bishop. If we wish to understand the power of Christ's blood, we should go back to the ancient account of its prefiguration in Egypt. Sacrifice a lamb without blemish, commanded Moses, and sprinkle its blood on your doors. If we were to ask him what he meant and how the blood of an irrational beast could possibly save men endowed with reason, his answer would be that the saving power lies not in the blood itself, but in the fact that it is a sign of the Lord's blood. In those days, when the destroying angel saw the blood on the doors, he did not dare to enter. So how much less will the devil approach now when he sees not that figurative blood on the doors, but the true blood on the lips of believers? the doors of the temple of Christ. If you desire further proof of the power of this blood, remember where it came from, how it ran down from the cross, flowing from the Master's side. The Gospel records that when Christ was dead but still hung on the cross, a soldier came and pierced his side with a lance, and immediately there poured out water and blood. Now the water was a symbol of baptism and the blood of the Holy Eucharist. The soldier pierced the Lord's side. He breached the wall of the sacred temple, and I have found the treasure and made it my own. So also with the lamb, the Jews sacrificed the victim and I have been saved by it. There flowed from his side water and blood. Beloved, do not pass over this mystery without thought. It has yet another hidden meaning, which I will explain to you. I said that water and blood symbolized baptism and the Holy Eucharist. From these two sacraments, the church is born. From baptism, the cleansing water that gives rebirth and renewal through the Holy Spirit and from the Holy Eucharist. Since the symbols of baptism and the Eucharist flowed from his side, it was from his side that Christ fashioned the church as he had fashioned Eve from the side of Adam. Moses gives a hint of this when he tells the story of the first man and makes him exclaim, Bone from my bones and flesh from my flesh. 
as God then took a rib from Adam's side to fashion a woman, so Christ has given us blood and water from his side to fashion the church. God took the rib when Adam was in a deep sleep, and in the same way, Christ gave us the blood and the water after his own death. Do you understand then how Christ has united his bride to himself and what food he gives us all to eat? By one and the same food, we are both brought into being and nourished. As a woman nourishes her child with her own blood and milk, so does Christ unceasingly nourish with his own blood those to whom he himself has given life. The price of your redemption was not something of fleeting value like gold or silver, but the costly shedding of the blood of Christ the Lamb without blemish. Through Him in the one Spirit, we can approach the Father. The blood of Jesus Christ washes away all our sins. Through Him in one Spirit, we can approach the Father. God did not spare his own son, but gave him up to suffer for our sake. Have mercy on me, God, in your kindness, in your compassion, blot out my offense. Oh, wash me more and more from my guilt, and cleanse me from my sin. My offenses, truly I know them, my sin is always before me, against you, you alone, have I sinned. What is evil in your sight I have done, that you may be justified when you give sentence, and be without reproach when you judge. O see, in guilt I was born, a sinner was I conceived. Indeed, you know truth in the heart, then in the secret of my heart teach me wisdom. O purify me, then I shall be clean. O wash me, and I shall be whiter than snow. Make me hear rejoicing and gladness, that the bones you have crushed may revive. From my sins turn away your face, and blot out all my guilt. A pure heart made for me, O God, put a set of spirit within me. Do not cast me away from your presence, nor deprive me of your Holy Spirit. Give me again the joy of your help. With a spirit of fervor sustain me, that I may teach transgressors your ways, and sinners may return to you. O oh, rescue me, God, my helper, and my tongue shall ring out your goodness. O oh, Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. For in sacrifice you take no delight, burnt offering from me you would refuse. My sacrifice, a contrite heart, a humble contrite heart you will not spurn. In your goodness, your favor to Zion, rebuild the walls of Jerusalem, then you will be pleased with lawful sacrifice, holocaust offered on your altar. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Jesus Christ loved us and poured out his own blood for us to wash away our sins. O Lord, I have heard your renown and feared, O Lord, your word. In the course of the years, revive it. In the course of the years, make it known. In your wrath, remember compassion. God comes from Taman, the Holy One from Mount Paran, covered under the heavens with His glory, and with His praise the earth is filled. His splendor spreads like the light, 
rays shine forth from beside him, where his power is concealed. You come forth to save your people, to save your anointed one. You tread the sea with your steeds, amid the churning of the deep waters. I hear and my body trembles, at the sound my lips quiver. Decay invades my bones, my legs tremble beneath me. I await the day of distress that will come upon the people who attack us. For though the fig tree blossom not, nor fruit beyond the vines, though the yield of the olive fail, and the terraces produce no nourishment, though the flocks disappear from the fold, and there be no herd in the souls, yet will I rejoice in the Lord, and exult in my saving God. God my Lord is my strength, He makes my feet swift as those of hinds, and enables me to go upon the heights. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We worship your cross, O Lord, and we praise and glorify your resurrection. For the wood of the cross has brought joy to the world. O oh, praise the Lord Jerusalem, Zion, Zion praise your God. He has strengthened the bars of your gates. He has blessed the children within you. He has established peace on your borders. He feeds you with fine and sweet. He sends out his word to the earth and swiftly runs his command. He showers down snow white as wool, and scatters hoar frost like ashes. He rolls down hailstones like crumbs, the waters are frozen at his touch. He sends forth his word and it melts them, at the breath of his mouth the waters flow. He makes his word known to Jacob, to Israel his laws and decrees. He has not dealt thus with other nations. He has not taught them his decrees. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. See, my servant shall prosper. He shall be raised high and greatly exalted even as many were amazed at him. So marred was his look beyond that of man, and his appearance beyond that of mortals. So shall he startle many nations. Because of him, kings shall stand speechless. For those who have not been told shall see. Those who have not heard shall ponder it. Please all stand. For our sake Christ was obedient, accepting even death, death on a cross. Over his head they hung their accusation, Jesus of Nazareth, King of the Jews. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of all, that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers, and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, 
free to worship Him without fear, holy and righteous in His sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare His way, to give His people knowledge of salvation by the peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. Lord, is steadily hound the accusation, Jesus of Nazareth, King of the Jews, for our sake, our Redeemer suffered death and was buried and rose again. With heartfelt love, let us adore Him and pray. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, our Teacher, for our sake you were obedient even to accepting death. Teach us to obey the Father's will in all things, we pray. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, our life, by your death on the cross, you destroyed the power of evil and death. May we die with you, to rise with you in glory, we pray. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, our King, you became an outcast among us, a worm and no man. Teach us the humility by which you saved the world, we pray. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, our salvation, you gave yourself up to death out of love for us. Help us to show your love to one another, we pray. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, our Savior, on the cross you embraced all time with your outstretched arms. Unite God's scattered children in your kingdom of salvation, we pray. Lord, Lord have, have mercy on us. We now gather all our prayers and praises into one as we dare to say. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass, who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Father, look with love upon your people, the love which our Lord Jesus Christ showed us when he delivered himself to evil men and suffered the agony of the cross. For he lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may the Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. God.